Hello friends, I welcome you in lecture number 10 on basic probability. In this lecture, we are going to discuss one more question on Bayes theorem. This question was asked in GTU summer 2021 examination. So it is given that a manufacturing firm produces steel pipes in three plants with daily production volume of 500, 1000 and 2000 units respectively. According to past experience, it is known that the fractions of defective output produced by these three plants are respectively 0 0.05, 0 0.08 and 0.10. If a pipe is selected at random from a day's total production and found to be defective, what is the probability that it came from the first plant? Also find out from which plant the defective pipe comes. So here there is one manufacturing firm which produces steel pipes in three different plants. So it is given that daily production of uh, 500 steel pipes is from plant 1. Similarly plant 2 produces 1000 steel pipes and uh, plant 3 produces 2000 steel pipes daily. So there are total 500 plus 1000 plus 2000 that is 3500 units. So this is the total daily production of steel pipes. So among this uh, total daily production 500 units are produced by plant 1, 1000 units are produced by plant 2 and 2000 units are produced by plant 3. So we can define three events b1, b2, b3 as say b1 is the event that steel pipes are produced by plant 1, b2 is production of steel pipes by plant 2 and b3 is the production of steel pipes by plant 3. So we uh, consider b1, b2, b3 in this way the production of steel pipes by plant 1 is denoted by event B1. Similarly, B2 denotes the event that production of steel pipes by plant 2 and B3 denotes the event that production of steel pipes by plant 3. Now if we want to find out probability of B1, then it is given that in plant 1 daily production is 500 units. So outcomes in favor of B1 are 500 and total number of outcomes are 3500. So probability of B1 will be 500 divided by 3500. So this we can rewrite as 1 by 7. Similarly, B2 plant B2 is the event that uh, steel production is by plant 2. So plant 2 produces 1000 steel pipes daily. So probability of event B2 is 1000 divided by 3500. So here we can cancel out 5. So we are left with 2 by 7. Similarly probability of B3 means production of steel pipes by plant 3. So plant 3 produces 2000 units daily. So probability of B3 is 2000 divided by 3500. So that we can rewrite as 4 by 7. Here we can cancel out 5. So here we have 4 by 7. Now uh, after that it is given that according to past experience it is known that the fractions of defective output produced by these three plants are respectively 0 0.05, 0 0.08 and 0 0.10. That is plant 1 produces 0 0.05 defective steel pipes. So first we define the event that capital A is steel pipes are defective. So if A is the event that steel pipes are defective then A given B1 is the event that steel pipes are defective given that they are produced by plant 1. So A given B1 
is the production of defective steel pipe by plant 1 so it is given that whatever steel pipes are produced by plant 1 the fractions of defective output produced by these three plants are 0 0.05 0 0.08 and 0 0.10 so 0 0.05 is the probability that defective steel pipes are produced by plant 1 so it is the probability of event a given b1 a is the event that steel pipes are defective given that they are produced by plant 1 so probability of a given b1 is given as 0 0.05 similarly 0 0.08 is the fraction of defective output produced by plant 2 so if we consider a given b2 then a given b2 is the event that steel pipes are defective given that they are produced by plant 2 so probability of a given b2 will be 0 0.08 and similarly probability of A given B3 is 0 0.10 so here I have written all these things probability of A given B1 is 0 0.05 again I repeat that probability of A given B1 means probability that steel pipe is defective provided by it is produced by plant 1 so probability of defective steel pipe given that it is produced by plant 1 is given as 0 0.05 similarly probability of a given b2 that is probability of defective steel pipe given that it is produced by plant 2 is 0 0.08 and a given b3 means probability of defective steel pipe given that it is produced by plant 3 is given as 0 0.10 so we have given all this information we are just writing all this uh, information in terms of Bayes theorem. Now what is asked here? So after that it is given that a pipe is selected from a, del uh, from a day's total production and found to be defective. So they are selecting one pipe from daily production units and that pipe is found to be defective. So, so this event is given what is given given that steel pipe which is selected is defective and it is asked that what is the probability that that defective steel pipe came from the first plant so that means we have to find out the probability that steel pipe is produced by plant 1 that is event b1 occurs given that steel pipe is defective so here it is given that selected steel pipe is defective and we have to find the probability that that defective steel pipe came from plant 1 so defective pipe is given and we have to find the probability that that pipe is produced by plant 1 so we have to find out this probability probability of b1 given a so for that we are using base formula the probability that defective pipe came from plant 1 equal to probability of b1 given a this means this uh, steel pipe is produced by plant 1 so that means event b occurs given that that pipe is defective so that is equivalent to this thing that defective pipe came from plant 1 so that is equal to probability of b1 given a now here we are writing the formula of Bayes theorem this is equal to here we write probability of b1 into probability of a given b1 here we are writing this same thing here and same type of uh, terms we write for b2 and b3 so probability of b2 times probability of a given b2 plus probability of b3 times probability of a given b3 so here we can we are writing this type of probabilities probability of bi times probability of a given bi and i equal to 1 2 3 in this case and whatever uh, plant or event is given here b1 so this term we will write here suppose we are interested in the probability that b2 given a 
then we will write down this term in the numerator okay, so that is the formula of bayes theorem so this uh, instead of writing in this way i can write in this way also sigma i equal to 1 2 3 probability of bi a given bi now i am having all these probabilities so that i substitute here i have probability of b1 equal to 1 by 7 probability of b2 is 2 by 7 and probability of b3 is 4 by 7 so that i write here probability of b1 is 1 by 7 probability of b2 is 2 by 7 probability of b3 is 4 by 7 and probabilities of a given b2 a given b1 a given b2 and a given b3 are 0 0.05 0 0.08 0 0.10 so that we multiply here 0 0.05 0 0.08 0 0.10 and because we are interested in this probability probability of b1 given a so we write this first term in the numerator and after simplifying we obtain that defective pipe is produced by plant 1 has probability 5 by 61 so this is the probability that defective pipe came from plant 1 and it is 5 divided by 61 now we are asked another uh, thing also uh, we have answered this first question that if pipe is found to be defective what is the probability that it came from first plant so that we obtained as 5 divided by 61 now they they have asked to find out uh, this probability also also find out from which plant the defective pipe comes so there are three plants here and they have asked us to find out the plant from which there is a possibility of defective pipe coming so for that we have to find out probabilities of uh, defective pipes from plant 2 as well as from plant 3 also here we have obtained probability of defective pipes from plant 1 and that we obtained as 5 divided by 61 now they have asked to find out the probability that uh, defective pipe we have to find out that from which plant defective pipes are coming so for that we have to find out probability of defective pipes from plant 2 as well as probability of defective pipes from plant 3 also we will find out these two probabilities also and then we will compare all these three probabilities and uh, the probability which is greater than remaining two probabilities that will give us our answer that defective pipes are coming from which plant so we will find out probability of b2 given a exactly using this formula but instead of uh, here writing probability of b1 a given b2 we will replace this by this term and to find out this probability probability of b3 given a we will replace uh, this numerator by this term so now we find out the probability that defective pipe came from plant 2 so that is equal to probability of b2 given a so this uh, denominator remains as it is in the numerator we are writing this term probability of b2 times probability of a given b2 and we substitute all these things and after calculations we obtain that probability of defective pipes coming from plant 2 is 16 by 61 similarly we find out probability that defective pipe came from plant 3 that is probability of b3 given a so here this remains as it is but here this is replaced by this last term probability of b3 times probability of a given b3 and after substituting all these values i find that probability of uh, defective pipes from plant 3 is 40 divided by 61 and we have obtained that probability of defective pipe from plant 1 is 5 divided by 61 and probability of defective pipes from plant 2 is 16 divided by 61 so if we compare then 
we find that this probability is greater than these two probabilities so uh, the plant from which there is maximum possibility of defective pipes is plant 3 so we can say that the defective pipe comes most likely from plant 3 so this is the answer to the last case question okay if you remember if you see this we are asked to find out that from which plant the defective pipe comes so for that we have to find out the probability of defective pipes from plant 1 plant 2 and plant 3 and then after comparing those three probabilities we are able to decide that from which plant there is a maximum possibility of defective pipes so here probability of defective pipes coming from plant 3 is 40 by 61 that is greater than these two probabilities so therefore we can say that the defective pipe comes most likely from plant 3 so in this way using Bayes theorem we can answer this type of questions this is very nice question using this uh, Bayes theorem we are able to decide that from which plant uh, the defective pipes are coming most likely so this is very nice question asked in GTU summer 2021 exam. I hope you like this session. Thank you very much.